Hey guys, and welcome back to another Naruto Shinobi Striker video. And today, um, I've basically today recently just just unlocked uh, Chunin, so I've been upgraded to Chunin. So I'm just gonna show you what you get after you get Chunin. You get all the weapons. I've already checked it out. It's amazing. So first of all, I'm gonna we're gonna go to Kakashi. So now that we're Chunin, we get for, if we go to solo missions, we get S rank missions. So S rank missions are really strong. So once you do all three, I've tried to do one. It's it's practically impossible. I did this one, finished it, but uh, that was before I was tuning, so I have to do it again. It's really hard. It's crazy. And then you get this mystery mission afterwards, so I don't know what that will give you. I'll probably do the S ranks as well. So you get all the missions that were like question marks, you get them all back. And the best part about being tuned in, yeah, is that Tenten Shunt gets upgraded as hell it's like goes to the next level like i think i think this is all the weapons in the game to be honest i don't think there's there's going to be any more that you can only get through scrolls okay no 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 scrolls we're gonna go purchase the costumes and avatar parts haven't changed but uh the figs have so we get the you can buy the violet it's not that much difference it's just the color and it's not even that much difference of the color either you get the green ones and then you get the iron knuckles and then you get claws and you get deep green claws okay so for attack it's just disgusting there's no good things for attack so you get the kunais as well for range you get the hidden cloud swords the same thing leaf dagger chakra dagger but you also get the kiba swords like you can just buy them straight away from thing and you get the kusunagi sword which is basically sasuke sword so you can buy sasuke sword for your range character after your tuning there's also the samahada you we already have and then we have the, the giant scythe which is hidan's sword hidan's weapon uh it's pretty cool i think it's the best like best defense weapon because it has it's this basically has the same hit rate and range and attack power but it's just way faster see okay and then there, there this is we got zabuza sword so we already have one uh, two uh, zabuza sword so we have a, see this is another one of the seven mists and swordsmen oh, sorry, i said that wrong didn't i the seven miss swords i forget it okay you know what i'm talking about anyway so then we get this one the twin sword here this is the thing is jochoro something sword it's amazing it's uh I, I it's actually so sick so they've added jojo sword and it is amazing but too bad it's only for defense i don't like the fact that the best swords are only for defense they also have the claw club the flame blade i think these were already here they got the frying pan though they did add the frying pan to the game so they have added the frying pan weapon they've added a small wife uh just a love shade knife the needles already here and they also add this the only new weapons for attack that i saw it's the boxing gloves it's not that good it's funny comedic but it's not that good but and also they have dumplings they have dumplings for the range type so you can literally fight with dumplings and yeah that's just about it so it's pretty cool uh i was i was really excited that they added hidan sword the kiba sword the kusanagi i'm definitely gonna buy it. actually i'm gonna buy it right now okay i need that for my range I, and the uh, giant scythe already got and the seven the basically zabuza sword which is just looks amazing okay now that they added basically the only you can only get these swords but you will just get different versions of them like different colors so look deep green is just the same thing but it's uh, green that's it like that's the only differences you're gonna have so i'm kind of disappointed by the fact that there's very little very very little uh weapons for attack i mean there is no swords it's all just short range weapons and i really wanted a sword for attack but i guess we didn't but i'm so, i mean getting getting tuned and getting all these stuff is just amazing so you get uh s rank missions and you get loads of weapons you don't really get any extra customizables i checked with sakura it's all kind of like the same I think you get just like a few hairstyles and stuff like that, but yeah, so you get tuned in by doing all the missions uh, up to where Naruto, the Hokage basically tells you to do one last mission, which is the S rank one, I mean the A rank one, and then once you do that, boom! You get tuned in, and then you see the credits and everything. It's very weird. But then once that happens, you you get to, you get to buy all the weapons without actually opening any scrolls. So which is easy. I guess thank you guys for watching. I guess hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, I guess subscribe. Please, please subscribe. I need subscribers. Please. I mean, you guys are enjoying the video, right? This helped you. 
And base that's literally all the weapons in the game. There's no other weapons. I've already checked. Nah. It's just different versions of those weapons with different colors and everything. If there is another weapon, which there probably will, because I'm wrong usually. But yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And goodbye.